What is up guys? Hello and welcome. It is Anime Mangoes here and uh, so today it is episode 4 I believe. Um, well, actually, yeah, it is episode 4. So, sadly, I will tell you I have recorded this before, but uh, so I recorded this but my mic sounded like I was inside of a turbine, so I uh, made the wise decision of not using that and just re-recording it so yeah hopefully it won't do it this time um, I doubt that it will so uh, let's uh, get right into this just like yesterday we took a walk through the park in the evening however that food stand was nowhere to be found it just so happened that no one was home on the day that I decided to take the two cat girls home I'd also happened to leave the house key behind, so to make good use of time, I went to do some shopping before Shigure got home. Oh, they're trying to hit us up with some of that good kush. That isn't the right word at all. Chocolate, if you're tired, why don't we rest a bit? There's no need for you to apologize. She had a troubled smile on her face as she nodded. It was pretty clear why she wasn't in a good in good spirits. That's why there was nothing I could really say to her. Well, there happens to be a bench over there, so why don't we rest a bit? <laughs> Ah, thanks. Something for everyone. Okay. I handed Vanilla some change and offered the bench to Chocola. She's so sad. The constant sea breeze rustled the trees in the park. All that could be heard throughout the empty park were the quiet sounds of nature. I silently sat down next to the disheartened Chocola. Like the gently setting sun, time passed by slowly. I mean, I do have to say something about that. If you've ever watched the sunset, it doesn't exactly set slowly. Once it sets, it it like goes down quick. So I mean, it's kind of like rising too. It goes really quick, but whatever. Her voice was so quiet that I wasn't quite sure if I had heard her or not. Even so, she answered clearly. Without saying a word, I responded by gently rubbing Chocolate's head. Of course it is. Yeah. 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 Her voice trembled as she frantically wiped away her tears. She stifled her sobbing and her voice became strained. She looked pained as she did her best to hold back her emotions, biting her lips. I held back my irresponsible words that were on the brink of coming out with all my strength. Yeah, of course I will. I feel bad. I was frustrated at myself for saying nothing. I was empty. I could only offer condolences that could not be put into words. I rubbed Chocolate's head as gently as I could. <laughs> I don't really think I'm kind at all. Sorry, I was getting a drink of water. Before, Chakula closed her eyes and smiled. Do you 
Ah, of course I remember that. It was a cold day half a year ago. Chuckle and Vanilla were huddled together crying beside the side of the road. They were still so young they couldn't even speak yet. It was that day that I embraced their small, cold bodies and took them home with me. There was no way I could simply forget that important day when our family grew. In the beginning, you two really couldn't get used to the things at home. You two wouldn't eat at all, which really worried Shigure. I started to hear a tiny bit of laughter in her voice as we reminisced about the past. I definitely remember that too. It was a few days after we brought chocolate and vanilla home. At that point, they'd only occasionally drink some water, and as always, they didn't really touch their food. The combination of malnourishment and cold weather had really begun to weaken their bodies. They both developed high fevers and were in pain. It's all right. I'm with you too, so don't worry. Of course I was. あの時、ご主人様がそばにいてくれなかったら、ここにいなかったです。あの時、ご主人様がそばにいてくれなかったら、誰も信じられないままでした。ご主人様のおかげで、ご飯も食べれるようになりました。しぐれちゃんとも、
絶対にちゃんとできるようになりますからだからだからもう一度だけお願いしちゃダメでしょうかだからご主人様と一緒にいたいんですチャクラ voiced her feelings clearly once again and barely kept her tears from overflowing チャクラ if you could be with me I was engulfed by my inner thoughts, which were ready to overflow. She yearned for me so earnestly. I don't know why they used yearned there. That's a interesting word to use for that. For her to so innocently believe in me, there should be no reason for me to be against it. That day, Chakla and Vanilla became an important part of my family. As long as they were with me, the days would be bright and enjoyable. I was simply selfish for just leaving home like that. I didn't want to get my dear family wrapped up in my selfishness, or have them experience any unnecessary hardship because of me. You two are important to me, after all. <laughs> My inner conflict was disrupted by Vanilla. Vanilla had returned at some point, and she looked straight at me as she sat at Chakula's side. I do that so much with vanilla. I skip her like talking. I'm so sorry. I do it so much. It was, if, it was as if her gentle, warm, and soft smile had become the setting sun. These uncharacteristic words from Vanilla deeply penetrated and seeped into my heart. だから、きっと、しぐれも私たちがご主人のところについていくのを許してくれた。しぐれは、ご主人と一緒に行くことはできないから、周りにお願いって。だから、ご主人が本当にショコラのことを思うなら、一緒にいるべきだと思う。There wasn't there was not even the faintest bit of hesitation. They were such honest and absolutely straightforward words. Who am I to dictate chocolate and vanilla's happiness? Only the words continued to strongly resonate in my mind, which was otherwise empty. <laughs> I just realized she has like this interesting bow up here. I know that's kind of like way out of the question or like out of what we're working on or looking at right now, but like that's pretty cool. Never seen a bow like that before. Okay, back to the story. <laughs> She was on the verge of tears, but Chakla's faces lit up. They were nothing but absolutely pure, genuine words. Humans really are at a loss for words when it comes to cat girls, huh? Saying no to their words was not something I could bring myself to do. It won't be like it was back home. 
You can't just live here however you like, got it? The dreary moments seem to be blown away by her dazzling smile. Which one, chocolate or vanilla? Or both? I don't know. Despite all this talk about family, perhaps I was the one that didn't really believe in it. Thinking about all this from their perspective, it was very simple. Although, I thought it was all still so immature. Perhaps cat girls were more human than humans were when it came to honesty. From here on out, we need to do our best all together. Oh, there's my little tubs of lard. They aren't even fat, so I can't really say that. <laughs> is that all you guys have been eating at home? Even if the road ahead of us is uncertain, I lovingly rub their heads. Disheveled, or disheveled, I don't know, or disheveling, or disheveling, I don't really know how you say that word, their hair. I spend so much time on that word, like, I, I'm bad with words. <laughs> You will learn that. Alright, why don't we head back to the shopping district then? We have to go buy that shampoo you guys liked, don't we? Well, today is a celebration, so why not? Just this once, okay? This was the beginning to a bright new life. And together, with the happy and high spirited chocolate and vanilla, we took the first steps towards it. Pretty sure this is like the intro. Yes, it is. Just so you know, this is a pretty long intro, so I like try to talk during it so you're not just sitting here watching it. I think it's like a minute and a half, two minutes long or something. Like, I actually didn't know before. Um, first time recording this that uh, Nekoparo was Cat Paradise, or is what it meant, but. Now I know. <laughs> Fade that out whenever I was recording this the first time, yeah. I have no idea why, but my phone is literally blowing up right now. I'm over there while sleeping and shit. Oh. It is very close to being uh, not good. Don't know at what point they're going to be introduced, but. Pretty sure it's on this day, right? Okay, yeah, there's the end of it. Like I said, I think that was about a minute and a half, I think, actually. That's about how long that was. Hi! 
Okay. You know, I'm actually probably going to end it here just because this is a good stopping point. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry it's a little bit shorter than the other ones. It's about 10 minutes shorter or something like that than what the other ones are going to be. So, sorry about that. Um, so, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I will see you guys in the next episode. And remember, stay sweet.